Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are new around here, hi I'm Madeline and I am so happy that you are here today. Today I am going to be talking about my January favorites and everything that I have been loving during the month of January. It's so crazy to me that I'm already filming my January favorites. I feel like Vlogmas was literally yesterday. It's crazy that we are already a month into 2021. Also, this is not a part of the video because I just got this today. But look how cute this mug is that I got at TJ Maxx today guys. It's like a Ray Dunn mug and it just has a heart on it. I just think it's so cute. Without further ado, let's jump on into the video. So my first favorite is actually a boutique I have been working with. I've shopped their clothes for a while, but I just started working with them. It is Peach Pistol Boutique. They are out of Georgia. But as um, some of you may know, I don't know if you guys know this, but I'm from Indiana. So I work with them online. They do have an online boutique. I will tag their Instagram and their website down below. I have a discount code. It is... Madeline 10 so if you want to use that code you can get 10% off but I'm going to show you my favorite things that I have from them. This is the first I believe this is the Be Mine dress. I tried these on on my Instagram story. I have a highlight of Peach Pistol now so if you want to see what this looks like on go ahead and look on my Instagram but it's just a long sleeve dress. It has big like kind of puffier sleeves. The bottom of it is so stinking cute and then it just ties around. I actually got this to wear on Valentine's Day, but I am so excited. This is the next shirt that I got. It is just a long sleeve crop top. I love the details on this top, how it's kind of ruffly on the hem. And I got this to like layer under shirts and sweatshirts and stuff, but I actually tried it on like by itself and it was really cute with like some super high-waisted pants. This is the garden top. It is in like a pinky mauve color. These sleeves are so stinking cute. They just have ruffles down them. When I wore this shirt to work, I'm not kidding you, I probably got like 20 compliments on it. Like this is such a cute top. I love this top too. This is just a tan one. I spilled food on it. I don't know if you can see on the camera, but I need to figure out how to get the stain out because I'm seriously gonna cry if I can't fix this shirt. But it just has these big bell sleeves and I love the color. And then I have two pairs of bell bottoms from them. This first pair is just leopard print. If you know me, you're not shocked that I have these. Here's just the big bell bottom and it is frayed on the ends. These are so, so cute. These ones I got to wear for my 20th birthday and I am obsessed with them. They're just a light pink, light yellow, and like a turquoise color. And then the huge bell bottoms and these ones are also frayed on the bottom. So those are my favorite items from Peach Pistol. If you check out their website, they have tons of really good sales and tons of items. They have tons of clothes, so cute. Affordable for a boutique. Boutiques typically are pretty expensive. I feel like Peach Pistol is a little more reasonably priced. So check that out and then use my discount Madeline 10 and you can save even more money. So my next favorite is another brand, but it is an activewear brand that I discovered at TJ Maxx and it is balance collection. I'm going to show you guys a sports bra and a pair of leggings. I actually have a like black tank top crop top from them but I kind of forgot that I had it until I started filming this and it is somewhere in the laundry. I don't know if it's dirty, being washed. I don't know. It's somewhere. It's not in my room so I'm just going to show you the sports bra and leggings for today. This is the sports bra. It is so stinking cute. It's like a snow leopard and the back of it is what sold me. This is so cute. It's strappy and then has like the hole in the bottom as you can see. It's a bit of like a longer crop top so if you had like high-waisted leggings I feel like you could wear it like without a shirt. But I'm absolutely obsessed with this. I wish you guys could feel how like <laughs> buttery and like soft this fabric is because it is seriously so soft. These are the leggings. I just have like a white, black, and gray marble pattern. This is what the logo looks like by the way. It just has these three rings. It's a brand balance collection. They are at TJ Maxx and they are so stinking cute, so soft. They have tons of different prints and they also have like solid colors as well. My next favorite is these face masks I have from the brand Kitsch. I believe is how you say it. I'm going to link them down below. But um, they come in a pack of three for 12. I have some that are being washed right now. I have like a tan leopard a solid like blush color, black and white tie-dye, a lighter pink, a polka dot. I think I have a darker blush color and like a tan one. And I think that's all the ones I have, but my mom has more. They have tons of other designs on the site. So they have 
a bunch of different packs and three for twelve dollars is a really good deal and these do not take your makeup off that is why i love these they're also super breathable i do not like working out in like fabric masks i buy the throwaway ones just to work out and so i can breathe but these ones you can actually breathe through and these are ones that i would wear to the gym and they're just so stinking cute and for such a good price so be sure to go check them out so now we are going to move into my beauty favorites my first one is the hand lotion from bath and body works i have the scent snowflakes and cashmere this smells so so good if you've never smelled this you need to this is what the packaging looks like it's actually a fall scent which i think is really weird because of the name but this is my mom and i's favorite scent it is so good but the reason i've been loving this is because um, I work in retail and when I work at the cash register, we have to sanitize in between every single person that comes through and my hands just get so dry from the cleaning products that we use and this has been a lifesaver at work. I just keep this in my pocket when my hands are starting to feel super dry and like crusty and gross. I would just put some of this on and it just moisturizes them back up. It is seriously so nice. I've really been using this a lot. and I've been really loving it. The next one is also a lotion from Bath & Body Works, but this is a body lotion. This is the Bright Lemon Snowdrop Lotion. This like scent has been a favorite for the month of January. I normally would not go for a scent that has like a fruit in it because I don't really like fruity scents. I prefer to stick to what I call the foodie scents like vanilla and chocolate and that sort of stuff. But I actually really like this one. I don't know if this is a Christmas one or limited edition or what. It is seriously so, so amazing. It smells so good. It's like one of my favorite Bath & Body Works scents, like top 10 of all time. If you ever see this scent, you need to smell it and get some. But my next favorite, I feel like I'm just so late to jump on this bandwagon. It is the Hula Benefit Bronzer. I have the mini one because I didn't want to buy the full one if I wasn't going to like it. This is what the color looks like. This is what it looks like. It looks super light kind of for a bronzer. It goes with my skin color really well and I really love it. I don't know why it took me so long to get this bronzer, but it might be like my favorite of all time. Like my new favorite bronzer is this one. My next one, I don't know if this was like a bandwagon I'm late to. But I know I watch people on YouTube that all use this shade. It is the MAC Velvet Teddy Matte Lipstick. I meant to wear it today for this video, but I accidentally put a different lipstick on. This is what the color looks like. It is just such a beautiful darker neutral shade. Most of the time I do like to stick to my neutrals when it comes to like my lip products and stuff. So I really love this for like everyday use. I don't use it so much every day now just because... We have to wear a mask and I'm not wasting this lipstick to go under a mask. My last two favorites are kind of like technology. I don't know. Um, I'm not like a technology channel, so I feel like it's weird to say that. But my first one is my Bible reading plan app. Um, I use the, I believe the brand or the company is Uversion. It is just this app right here, the... Holy Bible app. This is my church app that I go to when I'm at college. It is Traders Point Christian Church. You can actually watch them online. They're really good. So if you ever get the chance, watch them. But this is my Bible app. There is a page that says plans. It's just the middle button. And I am using the Reading God's Story one year chronological plan. Con chronological plan. Um, I am actually supposed to be on January 25th and I am on the 12th. I've been really slacking. There's there's no reasonable explanation I need to be doing my Bible reading. You just click on the date. It just gives you what chapters you need to read. Sorry that my phone screen is so dirty. I probably should have cleaned it, but it is what it is. I've been really loving it. There are many, many different um, Bible reading plans. You don't have to go through it chronologically. There's sections that like will take you through the New Testament first, like New Testament in a year, just the Old Testament in a year. Like there's so many different plans that you can do on the app. It is, I think if you just look up Bible app on the app store, I'm pretty sure that's like the number one app is the version one. So I'm pretty sure that's what will pop up. My very, very last favorite for the month of January is again, another trend I am late to, but I did get an Apple watch this month, which is super exciting. I did get a series three just because I didn't need all of the like extra stuff that the new one did or whatever. I just knew what the three did and I knew that that's what I wanted. My boyfriend actually got the newest one. I believe it's a six. It might be a five. I don't know. Whatever it is, it was the newest one 
and we have yet to figure out what the difference is between mine and his. So if you want an Apple Watch and you just want to do the basic things, I would just get a three because mine was three or four hundred dollars less than his, which is a huge price difference. This is my cute wallpaper. Yes, it is in military time. Before you guys say anything about it, yes, it is in military time. Then you click this little home button over here and it just has a bunch of apps. My favorite is this one right here that keeps track of my activity throughout the day. As you can see, I need to get on my exercise. The green one is your exercise. Blue one is stand hours and red one is calories burned. And then you can like change your goals and stuff. Oh, I just got a text from Ian. And then it can also track your steps and stuff, how far you've walked, how many flights you've climbed. Um, I share mine with my friends and like my mom and my Nana and stuff. We share our activity and then me and Ian are actually in a competition right now. Let's see if I can click on it. And I am beating him. I don't know if you can read that or not, but I am beating him on our competition. So those are all the apps I have on here. I don't use all of them, but... Oh, there's tons that you can play music. There's a Spotify app. There's, this is walkie talkie. The camera. Oh, I hit email. You can connect to your phone camera and use this as like a timer to take a picture. Um, there's like my fitness pals on here, my Bible apps on here. There's all sorts of apps, but I have been really loving this. Even though I was like forever late to jump on the Apple Watch trend, I am glad that I did. I really love it a lot. I basically got it to track um, like my activity, which is the app that I showed you guys, and I wanted to text off of it. It's just easier to like look at this, and you can either like talk to text it, or you can like draw the letters, and it will um text for you which is really cool i think that is all of my favorites for this month thank you all so much for watching today's video i hope you enjoyed it if you did please give this video a thumbs up comment down below what your favorites are for the month of january i would love to hear them make sure that you subscribe to my channel and also hit the notification bell so that you won't miss an upload from me